Boy Next Door done got me. I'm adopting it. They're my sons. All three of those songs were bangers, bops, classics. I don't know what the fuck to call them now. They're great songs. They were just great. And I like them a lot. And they got a really cute, fresh, bubbly style that's just really refreshing to see in a mist of a whole bunch of dark, angry, sexy, blah, blah, blah landscape. It's really nice to see just something bright and fun and very pop. So, we have a studio trim here, one and only. Then we have the three dance practices from the three singles, one and only, Serenade and But I Like You. I don't remember which order they're in. Obviously, we're starting with the studio tune, but we're just going to... But that's the way I describe Boy Next Door, just vibrant. <clears throat> oh, the... The hands. Even though I think that was guitar, and he did like a piano. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was the guitar. <laughs> the guitar. I think it's maybe because they dance with like big smiles that I'm just like, they're so cute and energetic. They do give off a little bit different of a vibe though with darker clothing. Because the videos all had like this really retro, vibrant clothing. It was very. Ah, go. But I like you. This one is a smiley baby. I bet in his profile says he just. He's our like healing or. What is that term called? I forgot. For like the comedic relief, the, the energy. God, I can't think- I've been in this forever and I can't think of the term. Like our healing fairy, our... Our battery, our energizer. Mood maker. They're very good dancers. But that's like such a repetitive thing in, in K-pop. Like, they're literally all such good dancers, that's the point. But I like their style. Like, it looks so fun. Like, you want to do it, too. Yeah, but I like you. Yeah. The eyes, nose, lips is my favorite part of the dance. You go. <laughs> That's my other favorite part. That drop. That, like, fake out of, like, we're gonna fall. Oh my god, I love that it's like very age appropriate too. It's just cute, sweet teenagers, like. Just very, very cute. Oh my god. I need to squeeze them. <sighs> Alright, back to one and only. Oh, we. The door prop is just literally part of the dance. Okay. I didn't know if that was something they did for Studio Tomb. Nope, just part of our... How do you do the dance without the door, then? There has to be an alternative dance. <laughs> I'm a fresh so clean. Isn't there one still hiding behind the door? Yeah. <laughs> I, was to say, I see a shadow. There's that kick again. Amazing, incredible talent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be your ideal type. You won't because none of you are old enough to be my ideal type. Thank you. You can stay being cute children. <laughs> so cute. Uh, that's be a broken record. Every time I see his face, I'm going to just be like, he's so cute. Bubbly. Walking down Main Street. I see a little. I don't want to assume anything. Okay, I'll have to look into the profiles and see if they're all where they're all from. 
but he looking like he might have a little quite mixed in. Just saying. Oh, the traveling on that was good. Oh, and then we're right back. Oh, their formations are really cool too. Their dancing is a little um, exhausting. They're very all over the place. That again goes to the credit of how high energetic they are. I'm the one and only. And then this, the breakdown here. Oh, bring that bass in. Who's there? And the cute little like waving back and forth. It's so adorable. I do love this part of the dance where where he shakes the door out and they fall out. Like, that's so fucking cute. I'm not sure how the physics works on that, but okay. It's a very memorable part. I'm one and only. Oh, with the heavy breathing. <gasps> that was a lot, I know. I know, we got one more. We got one more. Serenade should be the last one, I think. Yep. Did we do all these the same day? Well, I mean, we did release all these videos within days of each other, so. I'm so happy about their debut. Oh, God, the singing on this is so good. The style. We like to wave a lot. Like, hi, we're boy next door. What's gonna happen though when they want to try a concept that doesn't fall into the boy next door image? Like it works so well for right now because they're young and, and fresh. But like they're eventually gonna want to do darker... Like more grown concepts and they're not gonna be necessarily the boy next door, right? Or are they just always going to have that like really fresh kind of concept? Even when they try different kind of concepts, it'll always retain some of that like very innocent, sweet bubbliness. I wonder. I feel the same th thing of like Teen Top. That's so weird. Or like the boys. Like they're definitely not boys anymore. You gotta future proof your names. Okay, listen, I'm I'm down I'm down bad because my eyes really keep going to my favorite son there. Oh okay, no, I got two favorites. Alright, I, I need to quit playing. I'm I've mentioned my little smile fairy like 20, 27 times in this video. So like yeah, those two, my favorite sons. Oh, spin it away, girl! Snap. Snap. Is he supposed to have like headphones on? Is that what that's supposed to? <laughs> that was so cute. It would be you too. They're so... Please put them in a bubble and protect them forever. They're so sweet. I didn't know what we would get out of Cause KFZ, but I'm glad this is what we got. This is so just, ugh. It warms my heart. Like, I could see them being a group I get gravitate towards when I'm like n down and I need like kind of a pick me up. They're gonna be that kind of group for me. I can feel that. Boys Next Door. Their debut is so fantastic. I'm mad, as I've said a million times, that they are completely skipping the awkward phase of being a new K-pop group. That has been a very common trend in 4th gen. They are skipping. They're going straight to put together great music, great sounds, 
great dancing, great outfitting, beautiful hair, makeup. We're skipping all of the weird, awkward, like, what? who did that to your hair? Who? What clothes are you wearing? We're skipping all of that. A lot of the fourth gen have just been like, nope, we're coming out the gate, supermodels. We're going to be so put together and just look fabulous. <sighs> they do look really great, though. They're very well put together. Um, I don't know shit about dancing, even though I'm, like, literally sitting here watching nothing but dancing videos. I will say that they did favor in their dancing being very cute and very high octane over being synchronized. And I'm not saying they weren't synchronized at all. They were very synchronized. But it wasn't as crisp as, like, groups you would think of who are, like, ultra-synchronized. And that felt intentional. It did not feel like, oh, it's because they weren't ready to debut as dancers. It didn't feel like that at all. It felt like they were giving more of like, we're going to give you personality and we're going to give you performance and we're going to give you engagement. I could, I could see them be, being very engaging in their audience. Um, a lot of eye contact and smiling and cuteness over being super structured. They still had a lot of structure, they still had a lot of formation, they still had a lot of complexity to their dance, but I did feel that watching them, like, they gave energy over synchronization, which is totally fine. It really works for them with their whole, like, boy next door image, and it really works for the song choices that they have. Um, and I have no doubt that when they choose to do something more synchronized, it'll be fine like it'll work out i there was nothing in their dancing that made me think they don't have the capability it was more of a stylistic choice which is the only thing i noted watching all of these they gave a lot of personality a lot of stage presence a lot of engagement and contact i i totally could see all that but they're great they're so good already and they've only had the three songs this is all the same album or whatever same release period and they're already so great. I I hope that they continue to stay like this and that they give us more great music and and um, something doesn't happen to them. I always get nervous around new groups. Right? <laughs> There's always that possibility of like, if they don't take off, they might stutter. They're doing great though. They're amazing. Uh, anyway, that's it. Bye.